All right, this is Yawn slash Project 13. This is version A of three versions we will be playing this evening. Um, in this version, the narrator will be revealing three topics at a time. There are 33 topics total in this deck. Um, the narrator will ask one of the questions on those, like, uh, of these three topics, which would you fight, which would you not fight, which would you fight? Um, and then the other players who are not who are not the narrator will rate each topic individually either 0, 1, or 2. Q being a 0, Ace being 1, 2 being 2 for the purpose of this prototype. Um, there are obviously the 3 for each of us, but the narrator will not be rating it. It's just the other two players. Um, and then the narrator chooses the order in which those three topics go, um, keeping the ratings underneath of them. Um, and the narrator will place his guest card, which in this case is a little red die, um, next to the topic he believes will end the round. And of course, the way the round ends is the same as before, um, if the number is equal to or greater than the number of players, it, it finitos. Um, Anyway, uh, scoring in this depends on which topic the round ends on. If it's the first topic, it's worth two points. If it's the second topic, it's worth one point. And if it's the third topic, it's worth four points. So the narrator has some control of where he places the topics based on what he believes everyone's going to go for. Um, and then last, after the scoring is done, the narrator places uh, the used topics in the discard pile, then passes the button to the next player. Um, that person becomes the new narrator. Um, game continues until all 11 rounds are finished, and we, uh, person with the highest score wins. Yeah. Yeah. Alright, here we go. These are the first three topic cards we've got here. Um, and I'm gonna say, which would you introduce to your parents? Which would you take home to introduce to your parents? And off you go. Hide your rating cards there. Obviously, yeah. just stack them up. Right, Obviously, right, zero, right. zero for not, right. zero for not going to introduce to your parents. Right. One to maybe, and then two to definitely. Yes. to hmm. make this first, the second, actually, yeah, I'm going to make that third, and uh, what the hell, let's, let's just guess that we're only going to do the first one. All right, I'll now reveal, and got three. So there we go. I kind of assumed that you guys would uh, introduce would introduce the astronaut, astronaut. to our parents. Mm -hmm. Pretty so. safe, other than the uh, spy chick and the. Crazy I actually thought the spy plan. chick wouldn't get introduced. Oh, I was right enough. Um, yeah. <laughs> That's as if she was your girlfriend, right? You know, then then your mom would be happy, and if you want. All right. I am this is just random. Which is more cunning? Which is more cunning? Yes, which is more cunning? these any which way you want. There's not really a whole lot of... The first... If you choose the first topic, the first topic is worth two points. If you choose the second topic, it's only worth one point because it's in the middle and easiest to score. If mm. you choose the third topic, the third topic is worth twice as much. It's worth five. Okay. This is you're the gonna third. Go, you're going to go assume the yeah. number three, so reveal And that. how's the scoring going right now? I mean, like... Oh, I've got two score? points. I just wrote it down. Okay, right gotcha. 
got two points. All right. I'll be daring and bold. All right. Well, we'll reveal the T Rexosaur. All right. Starting with two points, you better get double zeros here. That's what I'm hoping. Ooh. Booyah! Oh. And David oh, and yeah. I both think the monkey is cunning. I thought the monkey was cunning too, and I didn't think either of you would pick this like. The army the, the, guy. Or right. Actually, he's and so the I sheriff. figured, yeah, the sheriff. So I figured he'd have zeros, and that this guy <laughs> would be cunning by default well, because he's... he has teeth, not because he's smart. <laughs> <Yes>. <laughs> this guy has teeth and a brain. That's probably and a brain. That's probably.